Hey everyone, happy December. It's that time of the year again for our uh, annual gift of Friendship Works in lieu of Christmas cards. Uh, just give you a little background. Uh, uh, Chris Grandy here, by the way, chrisgrandy.com and our whole community. Um, 2010 or 11, it started the firm in 2010. One of those years, we I started to uh, uh, come up with the idea of, well, you know, I said, well, people send all these Christmas cards. You know, and you used to get hundreds of them, and it's nice, you know, uh, get the cards and, and such. But, you know, you get hundreds of them, and it gets kind of monotonous after a while. And I thought, well, it seems like a bit of a waste of money. <clears throat> Why not make a donation uh, in the name of, uh, you know, our, our time, my business, my clients, and, and, and people who are, who, are, who are in my life, make a donation in your name to a great charity that does something really special around, around the time of the holidays. So Friendship Works... Uh, an annual donation of Friendship Works was born, and that's what we started doing. And just for those of you that don't know, or maybe you're with me for the first time this year, uh, we do this every year. Friendship Works is a charity that I found out about through a friend of mine, Father Bill, at St. Clement Shrine in, in Boston. Uh, way back in uh, the early 2000s, he was on the board of the predecessor agency. They changed their name. Uh, used to be Match Up Interfaith Volunteers. And, what, and now it's Friendship Works. And what they did and still do is they, they gather up uh, people from different uh, faith traditions to work together around the city of Boston to make sure that the elders in the community um, don't get left uh, you know, uh, alone. And so they started out with sort of like a reverse big brother, big sister, you know, like a little brother, little sister program type thing where they would match up uh, someone to visit with, uh, with, the, with some elders that were their clients on a regular basis. Great program. They've expanded it now. They have uh, not only do they have that same type of program, but they also have uh, limited programs where if someone can just maybe uh, uh, one of the seniors in Boston needs a help with something, you can go in there and help them on a uh, you know a temporary basis. You can make a long term commitment like their original program, and then they have other programs like medical visits. Uh, some people need to be taken to the doctor on a regular basis, and volunteers help with that. And they also have a pet care, a pet visit program where. Um, if people uh, will bring their pets or they'll bring pets to visit, so it'll be like pet visits uh, instead of people, you know, and, and, and all of these things do definitely enhance the quality of life of seniors. And the reason why this is so important today is that because, you know, people live all over the place, you know, especially a lot of my clients, they're, if they're older, their children are, are, not, um, are not in the same area. They might, you know, you might live here. But your kids went to school somewhere else, and then they got a job near where they went to school or near where is the concentration of their field. You know, if they're, if they're in finance, they might be in New York. If they're in technology, they might be in California. If they're in uh, medicine, they could stay in Boston. They might be in Cleveland. They might be in North Carolina. They might be in, um, you know, uh, in, in San Francisco. You don't know. I mean, or, or they may be in Seattle. So with people all over the country, you, you have the kid, their support network for elders is kind of dissipated a bit and for some people it's completely disappeared so uh, it is, this is a great charity that helps people uh, you know just a, a regular way a regular person's way you know providing companionship uh, nothing superhuman so um, a great charity uh, the director Janet she like gave me a call uh, many months back I did not call you back Janet I was I was meaning to I said well let me give Janet a call when I'm gonna be in Boston and with uh, Kids and such, I never find a chance to get in Boston. I used to be in there all the time for one reason or another. So uh, my bad for not calling, but I will give you a call back, Janet. So thanks so much for calling me. Uh, and uh, it's, it's a pleasure for us to help you every year. So that's what this is all about. If you're interested in more about Friendship Works, for example, if you want to volunteer, if you want to donate extra on top of what I'm doing, I know a few of you did that last year, and that was awesome. I'll put some links below the video. So I'm going to post this video. You'll see it on my YouTube page. You will see this on my blog. It'll go out to social media, and I'll have links to um, the Friendships Work site, how you can donate, and also a pretty cool video I found on YouTube where one of their uh, one of their people, uh, community uh, uh, managers, is describe you know describes in detail what they do. So that may be helpful to you. So hope you enjoy that, and uh, thanks so much for for being a part of my life. And again, this even though this is my personal email list and it just is about me, but I I do you know this gift is from my clients. You know. You know you know, I would say most, if not all, my clients I consider friends and have a great relationship with, and I really um, learn as much from you as, as and, and get from you as much as maybe you get, probably more than what you get from me. So you people are awesome, and 
love having uh, all of you in my life. So the clients are great, and also the my subscribers and people that just you know check in and and uh, like to watch my uh, my annoying videos and such. It's, it's it's good. So I appreciate all of you. And this is a this gift is a uh, you know it's a, a a gift to them in, in your name. So thanks so much. I want to wish you all though. In the meantime, a Merry Christmas. For my Jewish friends, a Happy Hanukkah. And uh, everybody, a Happy New Year. I hope you're having a wonderful, wonderful, um, you know, season here. You know, we've got uh, Christmas coming up and just the anticipation and what that all means is just, you know, wonderful. And I hope you can spend some time enjoying that uh, not get caught up too much into in the shopping, commercialism, and hustle and bustle. Um, anyway, we'll talk to you guys soon. I'll have some more videos coming up. Uh, and uh, definitely appreciate... Uh, all your support. And by the way, if you want to um, um, stay in touch with me, the ways to do that, chrisgrandy.com is my personal blog. I put my articles up there. I have this YouTube page. Subscribe to that. And you can also subscribe to my email newsletter where I send out uh, my video updates and also some articles and such that I've done. Thanks so much for watching. Thanks so much for subscribing. Thanks so much for reading. Thanks so much for donating. Thanks so much for being a, a, a you know part of my life. Uh, business personal however it all mixes with me when you're in this kind of business so uh, thank you thankful for you all have a great day